Hello everyone, welcome to the 1st of April Spellbinders Club Reviews. Let's get straight in and have a look at what we're getting with our small die. It's called the Faux Stitched Sentiments and Floss. So you can see we've got some lovely large sentiments and we also get a nice large layered uh, floss to go there with the whole stitching theme that we get throughout all the kits this month. And you can see that you can layer up the different pieces of the floss and you also get the little labels that go on each end. So that's really cute. Those sentiments that you get, they're lovely and large and they have that stitching detail through the middle of the fonts. So it's a really cute set and I think those fonts or sentiments are gonna be really useful. Next we have the Pins and Needles jar, which is our large die of the month, and it is a really large set that we're getting. So in there, you're getting the large jar, which also has a portion which you can make into a shaker. You're getting all the different elements that make up the scissors, the threads, the buttons, those adorable little safety pins, um, the reel of thread or um, floss and oh, look at that thimble and the details that are in those dies are just gorgeous then we have our stitched wall hanging and this is our stitched die of the month now you can see it's a lovely large stitching set you've got the large frame piece in the background then you get the stitched flowers and leaves along with the pretty little foliage pieces to fill in your picture or your background of your card and you can see just how lovely they look when they're stitched as well as different ways that you can add the stitching to those elements and it does look really lovely perfect for all those people who may be stitchers in your life or even crafted in your life who appreciate um, sewing and stitching as well. And don't forget, those flowers make a beautiful background just on their own. This month's Glimmer of the Month is called So Awesome. You're going to get a series of sentiments as well as a banner to cut out those sentiments. Then you're going to receive six individual plates which have our different types of stitching to glimmer onto your cardstock. So you've got things like herringbone, cross stitch, hem stitch and more included there as well as the foil. With the glimmer plates being individual pieces it means you can make any combination of design you like. You can also tape them together and make yourself a full background for a card panel as well. So next we have got our better press and it is called Stitched For You. Now this is a really neat set. You're going to get better press plates for the thread, the scissors and the thimble as well as dies for each of those. And I'm just showing here the uh, thread holder actually comes with a placement tool to use on your better press machine. So that's going to be very helpful in aligning up your different elements for that spool of thread because it does have different components. So you will get dies included with that better press as well as your sentiments. Next up we have our faux stitched flower 2D embossing folder and this is a really lovely set or embossing folder. It's got lots of lovely detail in there and it's going to look lovely whether you use it with the debossing or as embossing. And you'll see that lots of different techniques have been applied in the card examples shown. Whether you're going to um, ombre ink your panel, rainbow ink your panel, lots of options. You can also ink up your embossing folder itself or you can simply go ahead and fussy cut around those different elements within the embossing folder. One stitch at a time is the name of our 3D embossing folder and it's the perfect name for this embossing folder. 
look at all those different depths of sewing needles you have there along with all the little threads woven around and they look really good whether you're going to use debossed or embossed side you're going to get lovely deep impression and of course looks amazing with the rest of the kits this month our stamp and die of the month is called happy stitching and this has got lots and lots of sentiments that are perfect for this kit as well as having sentiments that are good for all occasion and you're going to get dies that cut out a lot of the large sentiments and then some of the smaller ones they don't include dies for every sentiment but for the majority of them so with this you can go ahead and use some of the small stamps to create individual elements you can use it to create gorgeous little backgrounds and create whole gorgeous patterns with sentiments this month's stencil is called rainbow floss background of course you don't have to make it rainbow that's completely up to you this month we're getting a set of five stencils so that's five stencils this month and you're going to use those to create your background layer of your floss then the individual strands of the floss layer over top along with the details of the labels uh, to go on there over top of those so it has lots of lovely detail and of course perfect for what our theme is this month the wax seal of the month is very cute it's called cross stitch heart and as you can see it's exactly what it says it is it's got this gorgeous cross stitched heart in the center of a round seal as well as a little needle and thread detail there so going to be lovely on anything to go with this month's theme but also will be lovely on lots of other cards that you make um, not necessarily to do with stitching. So the Deluxe Caboodle Kit is also available. Remembering that you're going to get everything I've shown here uh, in this video. And if you subscribe to the Caboodle Club, you're going to receive a set of Pins and Needles Sentiment Die Sets. That's a set of dies that impress into your cardstock, the sentiments, and then you receive the banner that will cut them out as well. So that rounds up our overview of the clubs this month. Let me know what you think. Are you into this whole sewing theme that we've got happening this month? I'd like to thank you also for joining me today. And until next time, it's bye bye for now.